night at 6 o'clock, a 13 investigates consumer alert for you tonight. Police in West Lafayette are searching for leads after someone placed a card skimmer in an ATM machine. Yeah, detectives are telling us this may not be the only one. Our Dustin Grove shows us tonight this new twist to a crime that can be really frustrating for police and costly for us. So this is where the card goes in? Yeah. Up here, and then they had it taped, and when they put it in, it stayed inside. And that's what that yellow piece of tape is there. This is the small device causing big problems lately at ATM machines and gas pumps across the country. Most recently here at this credit union kiosk in West Lafayette. We've dealt with the skimmers, um, but we've never dealt with one that's internal like this before. It's our first time seeing that. Police say Purdue Federal Credit Union contacted them after a routine inspection found criminals had placed a card skimmer not on the outside of this ATM, but on the inside. But this is something that you're really not going to be able to see. Frustrating for police and for people like Lynn Mellock. Wow. Okay, another level of breaching of... Are, oh my goodness. According to a report by FICA last year, the number of compromised debit cards from ATMs and retailers set a new record. In March, Greenwood police tracked down a whole card skimming operation with skimming devices that had allegedly been attached to gas pumps in 10 locations across Indianapolis. So, what can you do to keep your card information from getting swiped by thieves? Some devices are on the outside, so safety experts say check for any signs of tampering near the card reader. Wiggle everything to see if the reader comes loose. Avoid any machines in dark or secluded areas and report anything suspicious immediately. As for this internal skimmer. Concerning? Very. Very. The best piece of advice? Check your bank account often. They're always one step ahead and then we catch them and they do something else and yeah, this is a new one for sure. As for this latest case, Purdue Federal Credit Union says it's monitoring the situation and will make sure and notify any customers who may have been impacted. In West Lafayette, Dustin Grove, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Well, so far, police tell us there don't appear to be any victims. Detectives tonight are hoping some security camera footage will help them track down whoever installed it. We'll take a